Do you ever wish you could have a life do-over similar to a makeover or a house renovation? A chance to try something again with a different result? Try Again with Monique is a place where life's many questions and challenges will be addressed with inspiration, with humor, and real talk. You will either be inspired to try life again, over and over again, or make some really good lemonade from those sour lemons. Either way, I got you. Everybody is not going to like you, and that is okay. Let me say that again. Everybody is not going to like you, and that is okay. Your worth is not based on their opinion. You are worthy because you exist. You are worthy because God made you. I heard someone say, you could be the ripest, juiciest peach, but there will still be someone who doesn't like peaches. You will always be too much or too little for some people. So if you spend all of your time trying to please everyone or make everybody like you, you will quickly find that that is an impossible mission. Why? Because there is no pathway to pleasing everybody. Every road leads to a dead end. Think about it. Toys that are made for children aren't made for every child, right? Manufacturers and designers create and build for specific age groups, specific genders, uh, and specific interests because they understand that they cannot make any one toy that will meet every child's need or every child's desire. So if toys cannot be made for all types of children, why on earth do we think that we can make ourselves pleasing to all types of people? The better and the uh, more realistic path would be to be yourself and let the chips fall where they may, to focus your energy on who you are and who you were purposed to be, rather than who and what others expect from you. I am many things. I'm a wife, I'm a mom, there's a long list. But it, within that list, I'm a Christian. And so I believe that God made us for a specific purpose, to reach a particular group of people with our unique gifts, our unique talents, our unique self-expression, and our unique individuality. There is a scripture that says we are fearfully and we are wonderfully made and created for a purpose. I heard an expression that everybody is not supposed to like you. You weren't even designed for everyone to like you because you're not pizza and you're not ice cream. When you order pizza, you can customize it. You can add the different toppings that you like. No two pizzas when different people are ordering are probably alike. When you order or you buy ice cream, you can order different flavors and add different toppings like sprinkles. Uh, but people aren't like that. We can't alter ourselves or turn ourselves inside out for others' tastes or to meet others' preferences. For many years of my life, I studied people I admired and I picked up phrases and mannerisms and characteristics from them. I would try to handle situations the way I thought the people I admired would handle them. It never worked. I fell flat on my face every single time because it wasn't me. I did not present all of me or show up 100% as myself because I secretly wanted to be liked and was seeking the approval and the validation of other people. But as I grew older and as I grew wiser, I realized I was cheating the world by being a copy and not 100% myself. But in order to be myself, I had to accept that everybody is not going to like me, and I had to be okay with that. I had to accept that someone would always disagree with my decision or dislike my personality or how I express who I am. Now, I am not intentionally trying to aggravate anybody, but I also now refuse to hide or mask who I am to make others comfortable or to make myself more likable. I was designed for a specific purpose, to reach and connect with a specific tribe of people. I was never designed by God for everybody. Therefore, everybody will not like me, and that is okay. Furthermore, my acceptance and comfort with who I am means I show up in the world in a way that allows others to be who they are. See, your authenticity attracts and encourages authentic relationships, and authentic relationships 
gives everybody freedom to be and express who they really are. So be okay with being yourself, knowing that everybody is not going to endorse who you are. Those that don't like you, well, they're simply not your people. Now, some of you might be thinking, what if who I am is considered toxic or unhealthy for others to be around? Well, clearly you have some personal work to do. That is another topic for another day. Today, I'm addressing people who are generally well-balanced, meaning they don't live in extremes. They understand that they live in a world with other people and have to get along with those people, but they are striving for authenticity and they, they are, they, they're wanting personal growth. And I'm here to encourage those people to be all of who you are and make peace with the fact that everybody's not gonna like you. And that is okay. I wanna close with an ex another expression and it is the moment you realize not everyone is going to like you is the moment you take your power back. See, when you seek validation and move through life based on how others will perceive you, you give away your power to them. So if they like you, you're okay. If they don't like you, you're not okay. Don't let who God made you be subject to the whims of people. People change, people grow, people outgrow, people leave. So if you've been seeking others' validation and hiding who you really are for any reason, again, I encourage you, do your best to try to get along with others, but be yourself knowing that everybody is not going to like you and be okay with that. Thank you for taking the time to listen to or watch Try Again with Monique, wherever you happen to be. Please remember to hit the subscribe button so you can be notified when new episodes are available. Please like us on Facebook as well. Episodes will be posted weekly. Try Again with Monique is a production of GM Associates, released under Creative Commons Attribution Non-Commercial No Derivatives 4.0 International License. Remember, if at first you don't succeed, try again with Monique.